Please do this, Val. Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon, and especially if you're an NA fan of CS, let's get straight into the biggest story of the week. Sources, Blast Targets US for 2025 Summer Major. Holy freak yes! North America looks set to host its first major since 2018. Yeah, that's the last time an NA org won the major in Boston. If true, this would solidify the return of NA for the first time in seven years. Now bear in mind, South America received a major in Rio in 2022. It was a loud, crazy event where outsiders, formerly known as VP, won the event. Now, Blast want to host this major, which they did a great job with Paris last year in 2023. It was a great tournament with a mediocre trophy, but that was its only gripe. However, this is Blast is looking to run first Counter-Strike Major in 2025 in the United States with Austin, Texas, a likely choice for a host city multiple sources have told HLTV. An announcement could be made at the upcoming Blast Spring Final scheduled for June 12th to 16th, and the tournament organizer recently announced that it will reveal some secrets during the London event, including the format and locations for its 2025 events, quote, and something more, end quote. The first major of 2025 is scheduled for June 9th to 22nd and will bring the curtain down on the season. The winner major is penciled in for December 1st to 14th. So, middle of June in Texas might not be the best weather-wise. However, it certainly isn't the worst case scenario if it is hosted in Texas. Blast hosted its first Counter-Strike Major in 2023 in Paris in what ended up being the final major played in CSGO. Quote, it was a very successful event for Blast. End quote from Andrew Haworth. I hope I said that right. Blast's premier commissioner told HLTV in December, adding that, quote, it would be a great opportunity for Blast to be able to run a major in the new ecosystem. End quote. One in which partner leagues will no longer exist. The United States last hosted a Counter-Strike Major in 2018 when E-League ran in that year's first Major in Boston, in which Cloud9 won the tournament after beating FaZe in a dramatic final, arguably the greatest grand final in Counter-Strike history dealing with a Major. But Blast declined to comment when contacted by HLTV and Valve did not respond to a request for comment. So as of the moment right now, they are not confirming this. And yet the entire CS community already have crossed their fingers the US will host the biggest event in Counter-Strike. And really, NA has been overdue for a major to host. 2018 being the last time. That's seven years going ahead into 2025. Uh, last time I checked, um, that was Twist's first major ever look at him but yeah na since then hasn't been doing the best it feels like they have the lowest number of tier one tier two teams as oceana has been growing incredibly well recently i mean mongols just beat g2 a couple of weeks ago at blast and flyquest is on the fast track to be a heavy potential filled group meanwhile furia has been dropping more maps and rumors of changes to the roster are beginning to grow and on top of that team liquid has been featured in the news for their organization reportedly weighing cadian's future sorry that i did link in the description if you want to take a look at that article so yeah and it's not doing very well but hosting a major could be that sudden jolt to bring nacs back on top of that austin texas isn't solidified as possible cities have been brought up not just the community former pros as well bringing up boston seattle anywhere in Canada and more cities have been brought up as ideal hosts. New York and LA, however, I can't see hosting as it is wickedly expensive there. But this is some massive news in the world of CS as NA has been asking Valve, when is it our time to host again? And arguably the best major Valve ever had was in Boston. No, it's not an NA bias. Shut up. So Valve, please bring back the major to North America. But what do y'all think? Do any of you deserve a major? Comment down below and thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed and you want to see some more news, check out my most recent story here. And like the video if you did enjoy. Catch y'all on the next one. Have an epic day. I'm out. Peace.